This review is of Harris Teeter Diet Cola. And um, together in education, so they donate to that. That's great. Phenoketonurix, so if you have PKU, do not drink this. It has phenylalanine in it. No fat, cholesterol, carbs, or protein. 25 milligrams of sodium, and those are the ingredients. Let's give it a try. All right. <laughs> Tastes like diet soda. So, um, I'll give it a seven. Thanks for watching. Hope you have a great day. Hi. Thank you for watching my video, and I'm, I hate doing this, but things have gotten pretty uh, sketchy with my employer, and um, without going into all the details, which I have covered uh, at other times, um, at least in part, I need some financial assistance. If you have the opportunity to do so, that's great. If you don't, even if you can just put in a, a word of support in the comments, that helps. To to have even just that is, is good. Uh, but financially, uh, I need to be able to carry on doing what I'm doing with these channels. Not so much this channel, uh, not, I'm sorry, not so much the Eclectician channel, which is mostly just me learning about stuff and sharing it with you, but with my Glenn's Fast Reviews channel, where most of what you see that I review, I've purchased myself or I've gotten at a food pantry or somebody gave to me because they know I do reviews. But I have invested huge amounts of money in it. And at this point with a uh, little over 1,800 uh, viewers, um, I'm earning maybe $125 a month, which doesn't cover the cost of what I've done let alone the ongoing cost. And then even worse than that is my third channel that's at my, is uh, the PC Expert Amateur, which I have invested a large sum of money, money that I should have been saving for my retirement um, because I wanted to be able to present a lot of information about uh, fans and air coolers and water coolers for computers and other things as well. And in order to do that, I had two choices. I either had to make deals with manufacturers and sell my soul or stick to my ethics and pay for things myself in order to not be beholden to somebody and not feel like, oh, I owe them. Um, so, yeah, it's it's pretty costly and with the situation with my employer Amazon in which uh, the workers compensation company Sedgwick refuses to fix my shoulder which was injured at work over a period of months last year because Amazon's management refused to abide by their own policies to provide me support um, I may end up having to pay for the surgery myself with the help of my insurance and that will still be very expensive. And then uh, I would be out of work for at least a month. So switching to another job, it would be hard because if I come to you and you and I say, hey, um, I, really, I wanna work for you and you're like really interested in me and then I say, oh, by the way, in the near future I'm gonna be having a shoulder replacement so um, I will probably be out of work for a month. You're probably gonna say, uh, I'll pass, thanks though which would actually be illegal and you won't tell me that's why you're not choosing me. But you know, it is a problem, especially with me being as old as I am. I'm 50, I'm almost 58. So if, if you could please, if you can either go to the, uh, my YouTube channel, Glenn's fast reviews, and you can make any kind of a donation on there, any size, any time you want, um, through that, because that's my monetized channel. Or you can go to patreon.com, that's P-A-T-R-E-O-N.com slash Glenn M-I-I. -I. That's G-L-E-N-N-M-I-I. -I. And you can make a recurring donation. Um, the smallest one I have on there right now is uh, $10. If that's too big uh, 
uh, for you to give on a monthly basis. Let me know. I can always add a smaller one than that. Um, you know, I just need to know. Um, but again, I, I, if you are financially strapped, please don't send me money. I don't want somebody else getting into trouble financially just to help me. Um, that would weigh very heavily on my conscience. So thanks again for watching this video and, uh, let's make the world a better place.